on as well, go for all the white belt, white geed, purple belts. Okay, so you're here in your stretch diet. Okay, so stretch me out please. Okay, now again, you, you can, I'm not saying you can't force these off, I can't just smash this away and I can't get this in here. What I'm saying is that smashing isn't jujitsu, we call it smashing otherwise, right? It's just called smashing. Okay, so what I want to do is I want to be able to use angle and the principles of jujitsu to make my life easier here. Okay, so when he's trying to stretch me out and he's really giving me a stretch on the pit, he's got a very good deadlift, so he's got it on YouTube. So, <laughs> we all know it's, it means more if it's on YouTube. Okay, so when I'm here and I'm stretched out, this is going to be difficult for me and it, and it will be difficult. Even if I get rid of this one, he can kick more of the other leg. Okay, and then a lot of the time, people will jump over here. Like I can sprawl on this, I can jump, I can, you know, I can put my head through and start to handstand pass, which looks beautiful. But I'm still not really using jiu-jitsu and I'm in a compromised position. What I want to do is before this gets to this stage, as soon as I feel this stretching pressure, but really no matter how deep it is, I start to change my angle. N now this is easy, okay? He's doing all the work now because he's having to carry my body weight and even if this is out, this leg's light so I can bring this in, okay? Now, if this gets deeper, okay, almost any stage up to when it's a locked over plat, so if you locked over plat as me, Okay, this I'll have to change to a submission defense, but before those legs are locked, I'll go about the very same business, okay? So now what we want to do is, your partner's going to make this a little bit harder, he's going to try and omoplata you. So he goes through the omoplata here, yeah, yeah, so he goes through this. Does everyone know this, this move? Okay, you should have all seen this a few times, you're almost there anyway, and then back. Okay, so when he does this now, if I feel this is getting deeper, I'm just going to take my thumb, I'm going to try and rotate it downwards, Okay, which feels weird because it almost looks like I'm going into the submission. But I'm going to rotate it down to take the pressure off my shoulder. And I'm going to try and keep my hand in line with his spine. I'm going to hang my weight back here. So if he's right up in my arm here, okay, yeah, keep going right up in my arm. I can still get my knee into, this le into his leg. Okay, so my knee comes behind, although I can't quite get to my elbow, I can get it to his hamstring. Okay, so even if it's really deep, and he's really insistent on trying to pull me in here and using a lot of strength. Go on over plat me now. Okay, keep going, keep going. Thumb just stays down on the spine. My arms are no real danger here. Okay, my, my real danger if I turn my thumb up is the arm bar, not the over plat. I'm gonna keep it down. My knee here defends against this. If I want, I can push my hips towards him, towards that hamstring. Keep dragging me in, please. Really hard. You have to keep working for this. It's a tough day for you. Okay, so he's here working. As soon as I can, I bring my knee back in and I push here. So now he's really going to try and pull it into the platter. I should feel, and this is very important, I'm towards this quadrant over here. Okay, so if you look where my leg is, I don't sit straight back. If I sit straight back, do the same thing. I'm going to be muscling this. Okay, I'm over to the side. The angle that my hip falls naturally is the one where it's effortless. Okay, so I'm back at diagonal. And now he really has to pull all, all your body weight here, really tough. Okay, I should be fairly safe here now. Okay, so start to stretch that. He's going to try and drag me in for you. I'm a platter. Drag, drag, drag. Just the knee, cups of that hamstring. Let him burn himself out. Okay, I'm not going to try and pull my arm out. I'm not going to try and muscle him. Just keep burning, burning, burning. Okay, I can wait here for like 10 minutes. I should feel safe. And I should feel good to do. Make sense for everyone? Okay, let's go a minute each side.